Good afternoon. On today's video, we are going to be making bath salts. Well, not making them, we're gonna be packaging them. Almost forgot to mention that you will get to see our new scents that will be available soon, which is our cucumber melon, our oatmeal milk and honey, and our coconut flavor. So right now, what I'm doing is weighing the bath salts to make sure they are the exact weights that they're supposed to be, and I am so confused. I know what you're thinking. How are you confused and you made the product? Well, on my notes, it says that this should weigh 1.04 ounces, but 1.04 ounces is not filling up this bag, and I can't understand why. So at this point, I'm just over it. Um, I'm not sure why it's not equaling out to the weight it should be. Um, and I'm just gonna figure out later, move on. That's about all I can do right now. Okay, let's just get into the color. Like, look at this. It looks so amazing. So, I was going to call it oatmeal, milk, and honey because that's what it is. But that is a an extremely long, long name. So, I'm just going to shorten it and call it oat, milk, and honey. Um, and then I'll list the ingredients and people will be able to understand why it's called oat, milk, and honey. So I did figure out why the measurements were not adding up. It is because the weight is different um, when I am making the rose bath salts compared to the bath salts that don't have petals or flowers or anything else added to it because the petals creates, um, it doesn't add more weight. What it does is it takes up more space in the bag. So uh, things that have additives to it, such as the flowers, um, we have to do that at a lower weight, like 1.04 ounces, because those petals take up majority of the bag. That's all that we can fit in it. Um, however, when it's just regular bath salt with no extra additives, such as the petals or flowers, then we are able to add more salt into it because it takes up less weight, well, less space. Thus, it needs to equal to one pound four ounces instead of the one pound 0 
404. So that's why the measurements was off because I was looking at my notes for um, how we create our rose bath salt. And I kept thinking like I have too much bath salt left in this container because we weigh everything out to the exact T so that we know how much it's supposed to make, how many bags we're supposed to get from it. And so that's why it was not adding up like I was just so confused like maybe I was sleepy when I did this I don't know but I knew something was off because it was like one four full away from being full of the bag and I'm like this is just not right this is off so I did figure that out and I went back and I'm um, added more to make it weigh what it's supposed to so right now get into that color yes 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 that is our cucumber melon bath salt and when I say it smells so good like I almost want to eat it like when you smell it it smells as if you could just oh, it just the smell alone creates such a an experience um, but anyways this is our cucumber melon um, so we're gonna go ahead and pack those up Um, I've cleaned my workspace off just to make sure we don't contaminate one scent with another scent. Um, I like to go back and clean everything. Um, so now we are going to start packaging our coconut flavor. If you love any type of tropical scent, any island scent, this is the scent for you. It is just packed with coconuts. Get into that color. It is like a light brownish beige color it is just oh my god just the smell of the aroma it reminds me of the bahamas i love it so these are the heat filling um bags basically meaning that once you zip it closed with a little ziplock thingy um then you would go back and heat seal the top so that no one can get into the bag until it is purchased and then the person who purchases it would tear the heat seal part off and then they would be able to use the resealable zipper if you would like to see a video on how you heat seal these type of bags or where i got them from i'm going to leave the link to the video somewhere on this end screen um for you to be able to click and watch that video and if you want to know where i got the bags from drop a comment below i hope you love this video please don't forget to like subscribe and share with others see you next time